What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel Critical Overlord here. So I'm talking about Jeepers Creepers 4 in this video here again today. Jeepers Creepers Reborn. Now I haven't done a video on this series in a while only because of the fact that you know there's still just <laughs> nothing. Nothing to really get excited about especially for us here in the states but uh I, I don't recall which one of you left this comment but I'll, I'm sure you'll watch it and you'll remind me because I, I think I'm recovering from like a flu or something. So I, I didn't really go back and look at too many comments before I made this video. But uh, apparently Brazil, if you want to get excited for those, for something, for those of you who live in Brazil, listen to my videos. There might be a chance that this movie has a home video premiere in no, in November of this year. And it could just be, I guess, going straight to VOD or something in Brazil. So when it comes to Jeepers Creepers Reborn and a November release date, this isn't coming from any, I would say, source that we know to be overly reputable all the time until, of course, certain projects come out. This is listed on IMDb. Uh, so IMDb could be, of course, changed by anyone where they're getting this November release date from. I don't know. But for those of you in Brazil, if you want to do some digging into that to see about any upcoming home media releases in November this year for your country, then maybe you'll track down something to validate that it is indeed expected to be out in November for you guys. But for those of us in the States, this movie is still without a release date. We're still in the dark. There's still a lawsuit <laughs> going on. Uh, the next thing going on with the Creeper and this court trouble, from what I can gather, is taking place in November, not November, September later this year. Um, and we know the most recent thing that happened was last month on May 18th, where they had another hearing. There's going to be like some type of uh, case management conference that happens in September. Now, if I'm not mistaken, what happens at a case management conference is you would have both parties coming together involved with the lawsuit and their lawyers, their respective lawyers. And, you know, they would try to, I guess, s speed up the, the litigation process or try to, like, settle, see if they can settle this without, I guess, going to the trial that's still scheduled to happen in 2024. Uh, it's uh, definitely going to be where both parties are meeting and maybe they come to some type of agreement on something and decide it's not worth going to the hearing in 2024. But we'll see what ends up happening in September when this uh, case management conference happens and what details are then uploaded onto this website that's been very helpful in learning some of the truths about what's going on with Jeepers Creepers Reborn. I know a lot of you, I still see you day in and day out messaging Timo about what is going on with the movie, what's the release date and silence. <laughs> I've seen people comment saying he's not going to say anything <laughs> because of the lawsuit. Uh, I know the last thing he said that was like, I guess the most maybe again, like not trustworthy thing was that there was a release date. And it's funny how, of course, now we have to know there's a release date after this lawsuit was unveiled, but you can't tell us what said release date is. So it's like, okay, you're still doing things that are not really satisfying the fans. You, you're telling us there's a release date, but you're not telling us what the release date is. Almost as if there is no release date, you're trying to somehow, I guess, do damage control, <laughs> and it's not working. This movie seems doomed. This movie seems like it's not coming out, and if I'm being honest, going off of some of the things that we've seen so far from what has been put together to call itself a Jeepers Creepers sequel, maybe it shouldn't come out. Maybe this is going to be one of the worst things that ever get released if it does see the light of day. Maybe it's going to be a completely dog shit film that had no business being birthed into this life. And maybe it's going to be one of the worst things your eyes have the pleasure of witnessing. Maybe it's something you'll cut off halfway through. <laughs> maybe it's something that is going to make you appreciate me, me too. Maybe something that's going to make us appreciate Jeepers Creepers 3 that much more. And, you know, honestly, at this stage, I know a lot of you are already there. I'm I'm out in the mindset where I don't think this movie's coming out this year. Not only do I not think it's coming out this year, I don't think it's coming out at all. Uh, it's it, at least here in the states because I don't know how this could work if they manage to get it out in Brazil. If this November release date holds up any value for those of you in Brazil who again want to go out of your way to try to track something down to see if there's anything out there that can validate home media releases that relate to Jeepers Creepers Reborn happening in November if that's expected uh the, again the most recent thing that the states had gotten was 
a November 2021 release when we thought it was going to be going to theaters because that's what I guess the goal was and that's what was communicated to these other theater chains like AMC and other chains that had these tickets going on sale it's not that they just randomly pulled a giant a giant prank on everyone that's because this was communicated to these theaters that the movie would be here for November 2nd when they found out it wasn't gonna be able to make the release date they started pulling down the, the ticket sales they started pulling down the listings for the movie and it didn't make the November release date ever since then the states has not had another release date to kind of really get excited about I've been pulling from <laughs> these other countries and saying you know maybe since they're getting it in October maybe we'll get it too because again the states has been completely dry when it comes to release date news for this movie and again it might be best that we never see this this piece of shit <laughs> if it ends up being a, a piece of shit so I know a lot of you continue to ask ask this man about the movie he's not going to answer you in a with a question he's not going to give you an answer that i would say satisfy you as much as he's going to give you an answer that's going to just bother you even further if you allow it to of course uh because it I, at this point it's like okay this movie we know it was made but you know the more the more this just gets swept under the rug and the more fans are ignored when they ask questions Screen media in and of itself is horrible when it comes to marketing their movies. It doesn't matter if it's Jeepers Creepers or not. They don't really market their movies all that well to begin with. You know, all of this um, lack of news and details being released to the public. You know, your movie is dead on arrival. How is anyone supposed to be excited about a movie where, one, they think you've done a disservice to the way your creeper looks. Uh, they think that you have somebody helming the movie who really should not be helming the movie. And there's a lot of questions surrounding why, the, again, the creeper looks like that. <laughs> and, you know, just what what is it that you're going to do that is going to be this fresh start for the for the series that made because they put out a statement back in 2021 that Timo was the right person for this. OK, what makes him the right person? I, I feel like that requires us to now see the movie, but it's probably best that we don't see it because, again, it's probably a, a giant piece of shit. But <laughs> let me know what you guys think about this down in the comment section below. If you haven't already, of course, make sure you subscribe. Turn on post notifications. You never miss a video. In the description, I have links to my social media accounts, my Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can message me there, of course. Let me know any movies, news, or reviews you'd like me to cover in the future. And with all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video.